So uh, Rohingya, I'm a gender incarnate, I'm right here. <laughs> uh, gender incarnate justice activist from Brazil, I know you mentioned a lot about Brazil, and also part of the Generation Climate Cohort of the New York Times, so bringing a lot of the youth work to these conversations. So we know that the United States is one of the biggest emitters of carbon dioxide, greenhouse gases in the atmosphere, and we also know that the countries that are most affected by climate change are the ones that are least responsible for causing it. Right. So we have talked about the importance of mitigation, a little bit about loss and damage, but I wanted to ask about adaptation and climate justice more specifically. So in my own country, in Brazil, you mentioned President Bolsonaro. He's speaking almost simultaneously to this panel in the General Assembly Hall of the United Nations. And we know that in local communities in Brazil, they're fighting against deforestation in the Amazon rainforest, unprecedented heat waves, and human rights violations against environmental defenders. So given this very challenging scenario, my question is, how do you perceive the role of the United States in supporting and investing in adaptation mechanisms when we, we know that the countries need the most do not have the financial needs or the resources to do that themselves? Obrigado. It's great to see yeah. you, Renata. Okay. Thank you for going through the, the climate training back in 2020, if I'm not mistaken. Um, so, yes, this has to be a worldwide uh, response to this crisis, um, and it should include adaptation funding as well as uh, the financing for the transition to, to renewable energy, uh, electric vehicles, and the other solutions that I mentioned. Um, and the U.S., in my opinion, is still the only nation that it can rally the global community to make this global effort. But I'm hoping uh, that former President uh, Lula will be successful in your election uh, starting next uh, week, uh, and uh, that he will join this effort as well. Obrigado. Yeah. <laughs> um, 